What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Air Holler with MU Herd 37. So we're down here in Daytona. That little job is no longer there. But I think I've got, like, I've got these ideas in my head. We're going to hopefully work this out. Uh, things usually change. But here's what I got. Let me just look at that real quick. Wow. See, they could change it again. Because I didn't see that. Here's my my thought. We come over here. Oh, we're at Daytona. We pick up two cargo. One for that one. One for that one. The other thing I was thinking... See, this is five and a half hours. We got enough time to do that. Now that I think about it. Okay, but anyway. We take that. So we... It's two jobs. One episode. Uh, it should be pretty quick. I'm thinking... Probably not come over here and do this. It really depends on time for another job. So maybe I'll fly over there and bring that back. I'm not sure. Because we do have an... an another job two jobs as you can see here right here two to Bainbridge I mean one flight two jobs knocked out real quick uh, as you can see ten, 10 hours to do that so I'm not sure if we'll be able to go over here and get that and that's 3400 you know what we won't go over and get that I don't think. Well, I don't know. Well, I'll, see, things change. I'll get those two to Bainbridge. And I'm thinking maybe I'll pick up a the third, and then fly those two, of, uh, drop them off, and then continue on over here, and deliver that one, because then the next one is right here. So if you go over to Bainbridge. And then go over here. It's a lot quicker, but I mean, it's another thirteen grand. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I think to me that makes sense. It's, makes sense. And you got fourteen hours. Then when we're over here, we'll go over here, take this uh, back to Huntington. It's a quick twenty-four grand, and check this out. When we get to Huntington. This is in the next day or so. We've got Huntington to Wilmington. Huntington to Wilmington. I thought there was actually one more. Maybe not. But Huntington to Wilmington. Huntington to Wilmington. Wilmington to Huntington. Wilmington to Huntington. Wilmington to Huntington. Wilmington to Huntington. That's four. Let's see. There's two going there. That's six. The one coming, going up there, that's seven. This one's eight. This is nine, ten. That's all. Ten, eleven, twelve. So we got thirteen flights, something like that. I mean, that's, uh, to go from second officer to first, it's 30 flights. So if that's 13, I've already done several. I bet, I bet I'll have 10, maybe less flights after that uh, to get to first officer. I mean, that would be, it would be huge, a huge step up. So we need to get started because that's a lot of flying over the next day. And tomorrow, I want to get these done as quick as possible. Uh, this is Saturday night. Tomorrow, we've of course got the... Well, you won't know this because you don't know this is being recorded. But it's Saturday the 18th. Tomorrow is a big day in the NFL, NFC, AFC championships. You know i got to watch that. So, we don't have class on Monday. That's nice. It's uh, MLK Day. So, anyway, let's get these going. You know what? Well, 
me do something right here. 1433. Plus, that's Lawrenceville. See, that's going to be 50 over 5200. 3821. At 5254. Plus 2350. It'd be 7600 if I did that in one flight. And if I did that in one flight, then I could definitely come over here. Hmm. I don't. That's like over 3,000 pounds more than that. It's supposed to carry it with full fuel. But it's only 361 miles. You know what? Aniston, Alabama. I've been there before. I tried to get a job there. They didn't hire me. Bastards. They flew me down and didn't hire me. But that's alright. It actually worked out for the best. I actually made more uh, money that way. But, oh well. Like I said, I made more money by not actually having that job. Okay, but the first flight would be K A N B. And that's, uh. That's Aniston? Which one's uh, Elena? That one, I guess. Okay. K A N B. Let's try it. Hope that thing doesn't have much fuel in it right now. I don't want to dump it. K A N B. We're at K Dab, I believe. K Dab. Three hundred and sixty one miles. K L Z U, yes. K N B. Yes. K R Y Y. Yes. Oh, yeah. We're golden. Where's this? Whose job is this? I'm not going to worry about it. I was going to say, huh? pick up some more money. I should just show you. Uh, you can't see here. Uh, we're a little over 1.2. Two million in in cash. Those uh, DC sixes, man, they bring in some money. I'll probably tonight buy another one and get one going. Uh, I need some pilots. Usually, when I see, I check every day. When I see a good pilot, I usually just go ahead and buy them. But there hasn't been uh too many. Even when I don't have enough uh, pilots or enough planes for pilots, I still buy them, because you always, you never know when you're going to need a uh, new pilot, when you're going to be getting new planes and everything. The last game, I had like three or four pilots at, at a time that didn't even have planes for them, but uh, it's good to have them around. As you can see, I, I I need at least one more, two tonight if we buy another plane, so you always need them. Anyway, we need to get these done. Fuel's loaded. I will meet you in the cockpit. Alright guys, we're here in the cockpit. No time to waste. Let's get her uh, started up. Get this uh, GPS up out of the way. that over there to the throttle quadrant pedestal whatever you call it get that out of the way Let's work on the autopilot go up to 20,000 all right 
Oh uh, man, I how many times am I gonna forget to check the speed? I, I don't. I gotta remember to do that sometime. All right, two eighty five. Switch over to GPS. Uh, I think that's it. I'm not sure if we have to do that. I mean, does that mean that the taxi lights come on when we do that? I don't know. Uh, I'm not really sure why that's like that. But it doesn't matter. Let's uh, taxi to a runway. Taxi line somewhere, right? Just drive around, find one somewhere. If we can do all these jobs, if that's like 13 jobs or so, 13, 14, whatever, that's going to be just huge. Because I've been second officer for a little while. I'm not sure exactly when I turned. Let's just over here real quick. Yeah, I'll go over here. Uh, I'm not sure how many jobs I've done with that. But I mean... That's half of them right there. Let's say I've done... I've had to have done five already. So that's 18. I've done at least five, actually. So... The quicker, the better. When I was uh, checking jobs for everybody else, and I saw that Wilmington to Huntington... And then Wilmington to Huntington. And then that hit me when I saw three of them. I was like, because so I was going to assign one to the other pilots that had a Baron. I was like, wait a second. If I can get back to Huntington, you know, I can do like all three of them at once. And it'll help me. Screw the other pilot. I'll do it, you know. So I thought that was kind of uh, smart. I really need to get to captain. I really need first officer. You know, then I can fly the DC sixes and all that. But I think that that is kind of a disadvantage too. You know, with this, you can see I can do like three jobs at once and all. With the DC six, so many of those are uh, you'll be at like maximum, so you can't really do several jobs unless you do a bunch of uh, small jobs all at once, like, do five small jobs, six, whatever, just, you know, like that, I mean, I guess that would be good, I've never attempted that or anything, I'm just gonna turn here, I don't, it's just such a huge runway, I don't need it, or basically at the end anyway. Not sure if this is allowed, but I'm doing it. Shift eight. Let's get our strobe on. Two notches of flaps. Let's get her going. Take off. Trying to keep her straight. Let's 
go. I did a third right before we third notch of flaps where we actually got up. Gears up. Track the flaps. I'm surprised it uh took us that far to get up in the air. I'm gonna hit the autopilot already early this time, but see if we can get any cool looks out here. Out it at the uh, beach, so it's a nice airport. Big runways. Like I said, I've been to Daytona. It was back in like 98. Good times. It would be cool if you could see like the uh, Daytona Raceway. I doubt they have that. All right, back in the cockpit, let's, uh, hour 17, I'll do one thing. Get this vertical speed up. All right, whoops, wrong way. Let's speed this thing up, be back in a bit.
Alright, we're about a mile, uh, 100 nautical miles away from the island. So, let's go ahead and slow it down. Probably have to go a little faster since we're so heavy. see so okay five this way so long long size uh, runway 7,000 feet 612 feet up you have to watch out for the mountains I'm trying to think the uh, so I'm gonna come in this way okay runway five 111.5 go speed it up I'll let it go a little bit and I'll start the descent in just a minute apparently I didn't get that or something
All right. Slowed it down so we can over here. Let's uh, activate the approach. Now I'll speed it back up. Need to get to about, say, 3,700. Well, 3,500. 36. Why not? Switch over to the nav. This thing's going go crazy. Well, it's not going to go to the end of that thing, so we need to go a little bit lower. Hopefully, that's low enough. It's probably not going to be because we're missing even more. so much of the approach. Going way too fast. Hopefully, when we get down here, get it slowed down. Arm the uh, spoilers. Okay, we can switch on over the nav. So we are low. I, I just got us lower, you know, out of a caution. Lower the gear. Really wish this thing would slow the hell down. Alright, start with the flaps. Flaps. Full flaps. Hit the approach button. All right. Don't sink. Don't sink. Aren't sinking, I don't know. Why you would think we were sinking. Click the speed off. All right. 
autopilot off. One hundred. Well, we were low for a while. Not too high. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. And it. It's like at the end we just came down so real quick. damage so it's a uh, success I believe those are the only buildings here Blue park drop off some cargo I believe the other airports we're going to are uh, a good bit smaller less than 4,000 feet kind of like the one we went to in the uh, last episode when I was getting kind of worried about how small it was but because of that landing I'm not a uh, not so afraid it will be heavy Heavier, but I mean, we stopped real easy last time, so it should be no real big challenge or anything. So, hopefully, it'll be good. All right, stop right here, start shutting it down, get this out of the way. I was supposed to be off. Alright, let's go over to air hauler. Unload. K A N B. Completed job. Okay, 355, you know, on it. We're going to have to stop again, which I, oh man, I click that, we'll finish flying. I don't remember which one is next. I should have written it down. Two ninety five. You shut that down. I'm going to check real quick. It's the V cruise four sixty three. What? There's no way I can go 463 knots in this thing. No way, because I've been... That's mean I've been flying... No, there's no way. Alright, so next, next up, oh, we're already there, it's not this one, K-R-Y-Y, -Y. where is it, oh alright, there it is, K-R-Y-Y. -Y. So we're going to go over here, 
KRYY. Obviously, we're already loaded. Doesn't matter. Yeah, whatever. We're not obviously doing that. Edit that K R Y Y only sixty eight miles, so a really, really short flight. Won't even add any fuel. That'll just give us more weight. I'm gonna click fly now, but uh what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm gonna exit out of air hauler. I'm gonna cut the video, exit air hauler, I'm gonna try flight simulator and see how fast I can get that plane before the overspeed and then I'll just uh, continue on and I'll meet you back in the cockpit alright everybody we're here in the cockpit I checked uh, to see how fast I'm gonna set it start setting it uh, 320 instead of what was it 285 I think 335 is when it, uh, so I was saying 335 when you get over speed. So I'm going to leave it a uh, 10 knots difference because at the 4X, with the wind shifts and everything, it'll over speed. So I leave a little wiggle, wiggle room. Right, so 60 miles. Turn those on. I mean, I don't even know how to. 7,500, I guess. Obviously, don't even need to go all that fast. 300 maybe that's probably too fast yeah I'm just gonna go like 250 because we're, we're gonna have to slow down still pretty soon but uh let's taxi over to the runway we'll check this uh Somebody, are they taxiing? I think to the right is better. Wonder if he's going to the runway. We gotta beat him to the other end. get on the radio and yell already taken off alright set the flaps early but I want to get on the runway get this thing up I think it said four and a half hours left until the other job has to be done. The yes, third drop off. So, not this one, but the next one. Sweet. We're actually going. Oh, no, we're not. But still, long enough. 7,000 feet? No problems. Whoa. So the strobe's on. No way that other plane can already be to the runway.
No. So we're good. Let's go. So it would be good to have ATC, but the stock one just sucks. Not really even worth using. Positive rate gear up. Retract our flaps. I hit that real quick because that speed was that speed was going way up. Actually, we can go ahead and check the map. I don't think there's any ILS or anything for us. Would it all be visual or something? Well, from the other side, there's... Well, there is. But it's clear on the other side. So we'll go over and use it. Might as well. It's a 5300. 5300 foot runway. That's good. It's a thousand feet up. Alright, so 111.9. Check this save time we could just do nine I don't even really need to go to 7500. Switch it to 5000. 5500. Back in just a second.
All right, we're back. Start with uh, some flaps. Forgot we should be descending. But if it's got us, it's, a, it's a saying we're low. So whatever. No problems. Arm the spoilers. Flaps. See if we get the warning. Yep. All right. Put the gear down. more flats. Probably gonna be too high, yeah. Well, if this thing wants to descend, we, any time would be nice. We've got the autopilot. Stupid thing. Sink rate. Sink rate. Sink rate. Surprise it says we're low. Seems like a small runway. Five. Left to right. Taking my eyes off just screwed me. 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Oh, hell. It says okay. Scrape the hell of a wing. And I had to get that speed off. I had to take my eyes off everything. Or my hand. I forgot to take that speed off. Oh man. Wait a second. Alright. For a second, I went to a 
turn around spot. Strobo. I think everything's good. Check the plane. <laughs> that was that was a bad landing. Getting all cockeyed at the end. Trying to bank it in like I'm a little plane. Oh well. That's why I don't like, it seems like, you know, if you turn the autopilot off, the speed part should also come off automatically. I don't know why it doesn't. You can see what happens if uh, you forget, and then you gotta turn it off. Got, I had to take my hands off the controls and everything. But oh well, if it, uh, the heller doesn't think there's any damage, it's fine with me. Need to find some parking spots. See that machine over there. Stay away from it. Park right over here. And keep on this taxi line. Crap, this thing's gonna go in between these buildings and everything. Screw that. Go to my left and just park it. Alright, parking brakes on. Start shutting it down. Go to air holler. K R Y Y. So the next one. I have no, it's not very far, but just in case, we'll put a little fuel in. Yes, that's good enough. Let's see if we got, here we go. Go back to full screen real quick. Pause it. Start it back up. Nobody cares about the payload. Where are we going? Oh crap. Pause it. I gotta go back there. A L Z U. K L Z U. Unpause it. This set up K L Z U.
Yeah, only 32 miles. I was guessing it for 610 just in case. But it's all good. Just means we won't be running out of fuel anytime soon. So another short one. Let's go to 7500 again. This is even half as... Yeah, I'm just going to go... Oh, 5500, we'll leave it there. This is half as... Only half as long as uh, that last one. 250? That's probably too fast. We're short of flight. Let's check the map. Let's see. Oh, we got a... We got Isles. Well, that's 6,000. I was thinking these were like 3,000. Maybe it's one of the other jobs. But, uh... I'll probably just go on 7. Screw the ILS and going around. It's smarter to go around, but... Also takes more time. Head off to the, uh... Runway. I bet my wings just went through that building. Is there no freaking? Where's the taxi lines? Apparently that is a taxi. I thought the next to the left would take us out to the runway. Here we go. There is a taxiway over there. Hope this takes us over there. I think it will. Yeah. Into the runway, I think. Yeah. Alright, flaps are set. Turn our strobe. We were not at the end of the runway. Close enough. I won't do a rolling start. No. Bring the engine up and stay on the brake and then get off. Probably didn't need to, because we are light. But just in case there's any problems. All right, positive rate gear up. Track the flaps. Pilot, why is the vertical speed? Stupid thing. Select our approach. So seven. Gonna go to the right a little. Put us on a heading. I'm 
going to put it at 5,000 feet. So I'll speed up, be back in a second. Quick, activate the approach, let's hurry up and slow down. down to 4,000 feet. Gotta get this speed down. Here. Now it's slowing down. We're high. A little flaps always helps out the drag. Although, this runway is long enough. We're not really on... Looks like the uh, runway goes left. A little more flaps. to go over here and line up better. Stupid speed. 
almost forgot it again. Set the uh, arm the spoilers. Metamops. Now we're lined up like crap again. to the side. We were looking good forever. I wish this thing would show damage on a landing if you don't hit the runway. It should. It would be more realistic. They do if uh, you're landing on a grass strip. If you land on a grass strip and you miss it, it does do damage, unlike the Cessna uh, Skyhawks and stuff. Those can be those little grass strip lines. I avoid them this time. Last last time, uh, when I first started doing this, I didn't know to avoid them. They can be real, real tough. They're real tough to find. It's not so much the landing; it's finding them and then trying to land. And I was doing bunch of them at night and that's just that's it's real real hard especially at night to try and find them where did our taxi line go unreal that thing goes over to the little fuel thing so I'm not going near it. I'll stop here I like this airport can't where to park? Shut it down. Go over to air holler. All right, that's three jobs down. Man, it seemed like we were going to do a really good landing, you know, we were just coming in nice and slow, felt good, ended up not being so good, oh well, let's check out the uh, finances, 62.35, yeah, point threes, how much is it to Lisa? 1.2 so we got plenty there's no I thought about this one Lucy Fox I mean she's still got to go to was it the FATPL or whatever then second officer first then captain so she's got six I think to go up I don't know if she can get 34% but I may just hire for the hell of it she obviously will not be flying the DC-6 well she can't even get in it uh, put her at Wilmington I think th I took a uh, Skyhawk over there earlier Maybe someone finished the job. Need more pilots. I'm gonna get Lisa. How about the JEL? I think we got the Pan Am British Eagle. 
Let's get the JAL. At least said aircraft. Oh crap. Let me see where my pilots are. Good ones. Senior Captain. Jasmine is the other DC-6. So it'll either be Isaac or Cole. Looks like Isaac's got more hours. So I'll go with Isaac. He's going to KPMU. All right, I'll put it at uh, Huntington. Let me look for something. It's the DC-3. All right, so he's going to do that one flight. So I need to get him either over to Wilmington Looks about the only one, because I'm going to do that one back to Huntington. Yeah, he can't do that in a DC-3. Alright, so... Can he get in there? Yeah. So I'm going to put that DC-6 in Wilmington. J-A-L. Actually, I want to do a J-A-L. Ah, screw it. Here we go. Let's see if the finance. Yeah, there it goes. 1.7. I think that's the 28th. We need to have that. One, well, we don't even need it at the 28th. We need, what, 18 grand, I think, thing? Then? We'll have plenty of money. Alright, well, we leased it. We got another. Uh, crew member, pilot. So that'll be the uh, end of this episode. See you on the next flight.